Hi, this is Don McAllister, and welcome to another weekly tip video. Following on from my recent tutorials about ChatGPT, I wanted to share with you another service from OpenAI, and that's Whisper. Whisper is an automatic speech recognition system trained on over 680,000 hours of multilingual and multitask supervised data collected from the web. Basically, it allows you to automatically transcribe multiple languages of spoken audio to the written word. You can use this to generate a transcript of any audio or video, and we've been using this tool at Screencast Online for the past couple of months to generate our captions, and I've been really impressed at its speed and accuracy. The easiest way to use Whisper is to use a third-party app, and I discovered Mac Whisper, a standalone app by Geordie Bruin, the author of MacGPT. So this is Mac Whisper across on gumroad.com. It is actually a free application. Uh, there is a light version that you can download completely for free, although there is a pro version for 16 euros, or there are multiple licenses available for it if you want to use some of the more advanced features. Uh, the free application actually does very well, but with it being only 16 euros, I would recommend that you go for the pro version. I'll explain some of the differences as we go through. Uh, it's available on Monterey and Mac OS Ventura, and it is also available on Intel machines as well, although you do need those operating systems. But because this is a tip video, I'm gonna jump straight in and uh, we'll have a look at the application itself. So I have already downloaded and installed the application. So let's just run it for the first time. The first time that you run the application, you will be prompted to download a Whisper model. Now, there are two different types of models. One type supports multiple languages and the other type supports just English only. Now, I only ever use the English only version. So if I just scroll down, you'll see there are four different English models available. Tiny, English. This is only available in the pro version, base English, small English, and medium English. And each one has a different speed and different accuracy. Now, the one I've tended to use with Screencast Online is this one here, small English, normal speed with good accuracy. It's a 500 megabyte download. Let's go ahead and get that started. So that has now completed. You can download multiple models and switch between them if you want, uh, or I can go ahead and delete either the single model or all downloads, but I'm just gonna go ahead and close down the model downloader view. And this takes us to uh, the user interface. Now I have got a pro license, so I'm gonna go ahead and just say upgrade to pro. So I'll just click on fill in your license key and I'll enter that in off screen. That's just a quick preview of one of this week's Apple related tutorials from Screencasts Online. Screencasts Online is your premium source of Apple related video tutorials. All of our members get access to brand new up to date tutorials each week, as well as unlimited access to our entire video archive full of Mac and iOS related tutorials. You can stream and download all of our videos on your Mac, iPad and iPhone and even your Apple TV using the members only Screencasts Online Apple TV app. Membership also includes a complimentary subscription to the Digital Screencasts Online monthly magazine, published each month and packed with videos, articles, reviews, as well as hints and tips covering all aspects of the Mac, iPad, iPhone and all of the other fantastic Apple products. So, if you're ready to start getting the most out of your Apple devices, Visit ScreencastsOnline.com today and become a Screencast Online member.